the Pegasus World Cup Invitational is next. And 13 of them got invited, although I'm not quite sure how mine did. But there you go. <laughs> I did win a Group 1 handicap on this day last year. This week it couldn't win a cart horse race. Anyway, nine furlongs, Group 1 on the dirt. Celestial Path for John Morgan at the top. Dangered Beast for Dan Hughes. Filibuster Hare, Martin Leadham. Galo Chop, John Morgan. Men of Steel, Derek Hinton. Monsoon Sunrise, Paul Rhodes. Special Tonic, Craig Beckwith. Trapanga Lavella, Darren Thompson. Ultimately, Brooke David Robertson. Elderberry Symphony, Dan Hughes. Fort Apache and Government. Rank for Leon Van Rensburg. And Knight of the Flash for Joshua Sutherland. Installed and ready to go. No runners for Vinnie Gerard, so well done, John Morgan, flat race champion. And away they go. And can he go out in style with another winner? Kalo Chop and Celestial Path will be trying to do that for him. Endangered Be Beast at the moment is the one trying to stop him. Then Monsoon Sunrise and Trapanga Lavena able to be symphonies after that. Then ultimately, Brooke is next. In Special Tonic, Men of Steel in the pink, filibuster here in the wrong colours, then Government Rank and finally Knight of the Flash in the noseband is struggling out the back. But it's Galo Chop who's got the lead from Monsoon Sunrise in second, the Grey Celest uh, Elderly Symphony is third, then Celestial Path, Trapanga Lavella and Special Tonic trying to get into it. The other Grey there is ultimately Brooke, that one's coming through nicely, filibuster here, he's going to try and swing round the outside, but they've got five furlongs still to go. And it's Galo Chop who's clearing the lead from Monsoon Sunrise in second. Men of Steel, Ford Apache, ultimately Brook and Elderbury Symphony. Then Celestial Paths after that, an endangered beast. And Government Rank next, and looking towards the back, Knight of the Flash is still stone last. Galo Chop continues to lead by two. Two ultimately Brook in second, Ford Apache. And then Monsoon Sunrise, Trapanga Novella is next, an endangered beast. Celestial Paths trying to get into it, Elderbury Symphony trying to run on as well. Then Men of Steel, I think probably forget the rest of them but it's Galo Chop who's clear with two furlongs to go Galo Chop still in front from Ford Apache and Celestial Path and ultimately Brooklyn Endangered Beast for Pangalavella is trying to get going as well but it's still Galo Chop inside the final furlong Galo Chop from Celestial Path is John Morgan going to make it another one two and take the title in style Galo Chop from Celestial Path Celestial Path is flying and Celestial Path is going to get up and win it Celestial Path wins it Galo Chop second Endangered Beast third one sunrise men of Steel men against boys, really. How does he do it? Another one, two for John Morgan. Throws a few horses in and takes the title. Celestial so Path, the winner. Galo Chop second. Endangered Beast was third. That's probably going to be Dan Hughes in third, I would think. Let's take a look. Yep, Celestial Path and Gano Chop for John Morgan 1 and 2. Endangered Beast, Dan Hughes 3rd. Monsoon Sunrise, Paul Rhodes 4th. And Men of Steel for Derek Hinton was 5th.